here is a case of uh, left pelvic kidney with 1.5 cm calculus in the pelvis it's a ectopic pelvic kidney this is uh, quite just uh, beneath the rectus sheath thin patient the options were rirs lap assisted pcnl lap assisted pilotomy so we thought if the ureter is accommodable we will attempt rirs especially after the rgp because most of these cases some amount of puj narrowing may be there but in this case wide puj was there quite distensible ureter and uh, the axis sheath 9.5 has gone easily into the pelvis with this we proceeded with the uh, rirs after going inside fortunately that is uh, calcium oxalate more mono uh, dihydrate not that dense the stone was we used initially homium laser at uh, one jaw after some time the calicial anatomy will be different in uh, ectopic kidney if you push the stone it may go into a location where it may not be reachable so after some time it is pushed into the one of the calyx fortunately that calyx uh, with difficulty stone was accessible in such cases extreme torque of the scope may damage the scope that's why better to use the popcorn type of technique and make the pieces so that they will become lighter and float with the water and ultimately come into the view of uh, uh, flexible scope and uh, laser fiber like here initial attempt was uh, painting which is ideal but later because it has gone into the one of the calyx after this all the fragments are coming in view and after that we also thought uh, putting thulium fiber laser because it is very effective in the last part now we used thulium here it really becomes powder so when you make small powder chances of recurrence and chances of relook will be reduced in this case we have spent extra time total duration of the lasing time is around 18 minutes out of which 15 minutes was uh, homium and 3 minutes were thulium at the end we did rgp surprisingly the calcian anatomy is so variable the long infundible long calices and uh, three uh, the calices were different in different angles if during lap assisted pcnr or pilotomy the stone goes into some calyx it is difficult to remove so rirs should be the first line of choice in ectopic kidneys if fails then we should go to the other modalities thank you